Thousands of spectators stood in the rain to cheer on the runners in this year's marathon. They didn't seem to care about the cold, the rain, and the wind. News Center 5's Rondella Richardson joins us live from Wellesley, where the weather didn't dampen the mood hardly at all, Rondella. No fair weather race fans out here. If you ask, so why do they still come? Well, Wellesley College cancels class for the day, and it's tradition to line up along the race course. And if you're out here, it's just a scream to be a part of it. Wellesley College spectators create a scream tunnel. Marathoners keep running just to get away. It's just that loud. Nearly a halfway point in the race here, students hang signs of encouragement. And there are signs offering a kiss. It's a tradition. How many kisses have you gotten? 35, 36. The fun here keeps everyone energized. The finish line attacks of two years ago aren't forgotten. Those memories just make race day a cause to rally around and be part of. I lost a friend to, to the bombers. The entire concept of Boston Strong or um, any type of strong movement is really something that I've just come to associate as part of myself and part of my own identity. The guy who caused the bombings is in prison. We get to finish and he doesn't hold us back from whatever we want to do. Boston Marathon already was the race in the United States um, and then two years ago it became the United States' marathon. From Hong Kong, their friend's father ran by in his first Boston Marathon. Uh, actually, he didn't see us. So we sprinted along with him down the road, down the path until he saw us. But then, yeah, he was really happy. He waved back and smiled, and then he kept going. Now that is support, and many of these students volunteered along with the BAA to help out at the pasta dinner. Some used their dormitory funding to make those homemade signs and get up at the crack of dawn and put them out this morning. We're live in Wellesley, Rondella Richardson, WCBB News Center 5.